Hey everyone, so excited to have you on this 100 day challenge. If you're not meeting your goals and you haven't stuck with something for at least 100 days, then you're probably not gonna meet your, meet your goals. And I'm, all of what I'm talking about and part of this 100 day challenge is living your leanest life. It is so common to go into the new year with all of these goals to be as fit and healthy and lean and work on your body and fit better in your clothes. And how do you do that? And why don't we, most people meet their goals? Well, I'm gonna talk about this in the last 20 days of the year and into next year. And I'm gonna share my secrets and how I've stayed lean for over 20 years and what I highly recommend you starting with on day one, day two, day three, all the way to day 20 into next year. And what if you became your leanest, fittest, healthiest self starting this year and you never stopped for the next 20 years? What would that look like? What do the next 100 days look like for you? What are you going to choose to stick to? It's only going to take a couple minutes a day to learn. And then it's up to you to put these principles and these ideas, uh, these new thought patterns, these new movements into place. And I have never been more excited to share. Are you showing up in your life? And you may look at me and say, hmm, what is Divya talking about? So here's what I want to challenge yourself. Are you so caught up in your thoughts? Are you caught up in those doubts? Are you caught up in day-to-day -day busyness that you're rushing through the given moment that you have to be somewhere? It could be getting those groceries or getting your kids or getting to the job or getting to that client or getting to the doctor's appointment. Don't forget the now. And... Because this now will become your foundation to the story you will be writing, not only for tomorrow, but for the next few weeks, for next few months, next years. So a lot of people don't think about it. But what you're experiencing today is based on what you created yesterday. So what will you create today and in these 100-day challenge? that you will become the leader of your story and you'll be authoring it. Hi, I'm Elizabeth Wells and I look forward to being with you on this journey. Let's get inspired together. I am going to be serving the, your creativity, your laughter, your peace, helping you both honor grief, connect to love, and then connect to those creative seeds in your heart through peaceful practices and writing practices and creative practices. So I hope you will join us on this full 100 day journey and let's connect with each other in the comments because that is where we can feel inspired, get inspired and be with each other, um, helping us seed the world with our creative gifts because this world has a lot of needs and your creativity is a gift to a world in need. So looking forward to seeing you, have fun with it and lots of love. Okay, bye for now. My name is Monica Lynn. I am a kingdom mindset coach and why having faith intertwined with your mindset is so crucial. I know for me, whether it was studying psychology 20 years ago, being on my own uh, journey and my faith journey, mindset for me was everything. With my faith intertwined with my mindset, I was able to gain perspective on challenges and a whole new light. I was able to really see things from a higher perspective that could carry me through, which led to significant changes in my life. It led to being able to fulfill the things, the, the visions that I had. And this allowed me the opportunity to be open to the changes. Now, there's nothing better when you're joining together with people who have big visions and big goals and big dreams and they're to support each other and, and be the black sheep, right? Be the ones who are like, hey, you've got this, you can do this. You know, we've combined, we've, we've done incredible things and we can keep doing incredible things. Hi, I'm Rose Higgins, and I'm super excited and honored to be a part of your 100-day journey. So together, on this 100-day journey, we are going to delve into all the amazing pieces that are going to come together and create an amazing and a purposeful habit. And that habit is your impact, your legacy. 
If you spend just five, 10 minutes a day planning your legacy, imagine at the end of the year, 100 days, how much impact and purpose you will have clarity on. And I guarantee you, if you don't plan your purpose and your legacy, nothing will happen. So it's up to you to choose to invest yourself in these 100 days and we're here to support you. If you miss a day, come back. We're here to support you through the ups and the downs. We're here to be your purpose partners. I'm honored to be here, honored to serve you. Have a blessed day.